Hey fellas, welcome to my playthrough of The Karaoke. You thought that I wasn't going to upload today, probably, because I haven't been consistent, but guess what? I was waiting for this game, and uh, in the meanwhile I was working on my own stuff. But other than that, I, uh, I bought a bunch of weird drinks the other day, and today I'm drinking Super Supau. And if you're wondering what it tastes like, it's... I've never tasted coconut water and lime before. I don't know what makes it a sports drink either. But anyway, let's play this game. This so we're b-ballers. It's cool. I'm a baller. A shot caller. Okay. <laughs> I thought her head would twist all the way around for some reason. I mean, if stuff like this is happening, then, you know, we couldn't be too far from that. Let's practice free throws. Ah, uh, you go ahead. I'm I'm more into Duncan. That is uh Let me show you how it's done. I'm going to go all around the house. Oh, okay. I have no fucking strength. All right. Like that's Look, if you if you can't make something like that, then I don't know how you plan to do anything. Oh, come on. Okay, well, we're gonna just say we made it. We're, we need the backboard. Oh, you son of a bitch. Let me get the angle just right. See, there's an arc to this. Oh, oh my god. Uh, we, we're gonna make one. Nice, uh, absolutely. All right, here we go. Hmm. All right, let's see you do it. Yeah, you don't stand a fucking chance. With the way you're playing, I suggest you go to tennis. <laughs> Fuck. Is there something I should be doing right now? Here is the layup. We should get going. Hey, you two. Can't you two read the clock? Time to go home. Yeah, bye. I'll clean up. You go ahead. I'm not leaving you with this guy. What? That's ridiculous. Not cool. Why would we actually leave? I would never. I'm glad I went over here. Open locker. Whoa, 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 whoa. There's a lot of shit going on here. Hold on a second. <laughs> uh, fuck it. Yeah, let's do it. What is this? Mocha's key. Is this my key? I don't understand. Are we fucking with somebody? Whatever. Let's, uh... Put shoes. Is this a new day? Or am I going home? I don't understand. I'll use the deodorant. I'll change clothes. Okay, we're going home. We're just changing. And I'll take my bag. Okay, I guess we can't get in there anymore. It's okay, we don't need to. That's a cool little Chilla's Art logo. Ah, look at that. Oh my god, are these just all supporter contents? You didn't even try this time. You were just like, fuck it, throw them in a bin. <laughs> Dude's got like 500 Patreon supporters, I don't blame him. But I didn't, I didn't expect him to be so ballsy that he'd just throw them all in a bin. Oh, that's kind of funny. Alright, let's get out of here. 
I don't know if I've asked, but I hope you guys are doing well. I gotta get my bike. And I'm assuming it's somewhere over there, but... In a Chilizar game... If you've seen me play any Chilizar game, you'll know that you gotta go across the map to pick up a crow's head to drop it off at a dumpster on the other side of town to get a key to open up a chest with a wooden statue that you could put in a fireplace and grab the ashes to uh, power your vehicle. That's what Chilazar games are like, so I'm fucking going around this building, and you can't stop me. Alright, cool. Thoroughly investigated. We can, we can go the intended way now. This game is running really well. I'm, I'm really proud of Chilla's art. They've grown a lot in the last couple of years. If you're not aware, their games used to run like absolute dog shit. I'm glad to see it's better now. Thoroughly investigate? Nah, it's fine. I will say that, uh... These, like, objective markers are not welcome here. I don't like them. Like, I know I complain about them all the time when I play their other games, but that doesn't mean that I need the hand-holding, you know? It's condescending. Alright. Is, is she just left her bag in there? Is that smart? Get on the bike? Eight questions like this. By the way, this game has six fucking endings. I don't know how easy it is to get these endings. I'm going to assume that it's relatively easy. Whatever ending we get first is the one we get. And then we'll work our way from there. Sweet. Whee! Oh, this is fun. We probably shouldn't be... Over there, right? This is the bike lane. But where do we live? Oh, the police station. Karaoke? Well, that's the name of the game. Oh, I really don't like this. Karaoke. I don't know. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. But I feel like I could be attacked from anywhere, and I really don't like... Oh. Dude, you came into the intersection, and you didn't stop. That's on you. Oh, I fucking hate it. Oh my god, if I lived in this place, I would fucking never. Oh, Jesus Christ, that's so loud. Get your dog on a leash, bitch. Oh my god. Who strapped a megaphone to that dog's throat? And what are we doing? <laughs> Why? Is this a shortcut? I just want to go home. I don't care about karaoke anymore. I think karaoke is, uh, is over. This is a fucking ghost town. And I just don't like it. There's that same van. Now what? Mocha. Moshi mosh. Sorry. I got stopped by the coach. You go ahead and sing. Okay, but... You okay? I'll be fine. I'll catch up with you later. This is not fine. This is the worst possible outcome. Oh, we're a terrible friend. You know, we, we deserve whatever happens to us. 
I could never leave her alone there. Impossible. Damn, look at this vehicle. It don't even got fucking wheels on it. It's got like glass tires. Can I help you, man? Like, this is some scary shit that you're doing here. What's the deal? Can I leave? No. Why would we be able to do that? Oh, look. It's more bargain bin supporters on Patreon. Let's English. Looking at you. I like this guy, whoever it is. Let's do it. Chicken Cube. Africa TV. Africa TV. White Dragon. But not a Blue Eyes. Alright, that's enough of that. Let's karaoke. Wait, not yet. Is there anything over here? You never know, like I said. You never know. You might need a puzzle piece that you found in a Bible on the day one that you'll use on day seven. It just... it, it It's chill as art. What can you do? Employee. Oh, look, another one. <laughs> I'm so sorry, supporters. This is awful. Delegated to cardboard boxes and... Ugh. Bodyguard. How do I get how do I get my logo in one of these boxes? I guess I gotta support on Patreon. Karaoke employee. Um, excuse me. Oh, hi. Uh yes. I wanna check in for two students for two hours. Hi. Alright then. Uh please use room twelve. Feel free to use the drink bar as well. Oh my... Who the hell are you talking to? It's blurred. Watching porn. Can't make up your mind, huh? Between... Kanji and Kanji and Kanji. It's tough, I know. I want... I guess I don't have a cup, and I can't grab one of these, so we gotta find a cup. And we're in room 12. Oh. Also, there was like a disclaimer in the beginning of the game that said... Fucking Mocha. No. Don't come any closer. What? I can't hear you. Hello? Can you hear me? Don't. Oh my god. Mood ruined. How am I su I'm supposed to walk into this room and sing for two hours? It's locked. Alright, so I think the bulk of this game will be played in the karaoke room. We need to solve the mystery of the karaoke. Janitorial closet. There's always one. Oh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, all the songs in this game are copyright free. Apparently. So that's cool. Let's enter karaoke room. Damn. 144 PhD TV. All right, let's see. Oh, is there a mini game? I fucking slam on mini games. Trust me. I don't know if I want to play Ripe Fruit though. Can I control this at all? Okay, I can. Let's lower calibration. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means either. Um, Lost Demon Rest. Let's walk to the future. Ripe Fruit. Should we start from top to bottom? I guess. I just don't really want to play ripe fruit, you know? Never mind, it's fucking awesome.
karaoke minigame tutorial. RFV, excuse me? RFV. Press RV to hit the notes coming from the right. You can change the calibration timing and difficulty at the left side of the tablet screen. Dude, I don't even know how to... I'm about to turn my keyboard sideways for this. Oh, man. Okay. Oh. I'm already so good. What? did I, It said food and it distracted me. I wish I could sing along. It totally says food, right? Ah! I fuck at these. I fuck at these. <laughs> oh my god, I can't stop missing. I feel like these don't really go with the song. I'm dyslexic. Ah, uh, da da da. Do 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 do. Oh, look at the Chilla's art with the sombrero. That was Ripe Fruit by Tech Music. Apparently copyright free. Which is kind of awesome. Getting a bit thirsty. Touch panel to end song. Dude, I swear, like, the first time I missed... Alright, the first time I got a good... I swear it read food, and it made me miss the next note. I just, I was too distracted. I should get myself a drink at the drink bar. Fuck that, we got a song to, whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, I guess I can't. I gotta go get water? Man, I really am an awful person, though. The hell is wrong with you? All right, let's grab one of these. Um, I'll get some ice and uh, this corn pumpkin. I don't like any of that. I don't even think I can get it. Now this. All right, so I know that's Coke. That's Coke Zero. That's melon. That's probably black tea. That's gotta be a uh, fucking Calpico or something. Um, peppermint something. Ah, I'm gonna go ahead and assume that this is like strawberry and I'm down for that right now. There are some people that have strawberry allergies and uh, that's why you gotta make sure that you appreciate the finer things in life, like strawberry soda, strawberry drinks, pink drinks, you know, that kind of thing. Do I just, how do I drink this? Can I even drink it? Oh, Jesus, you fucking son of a bitch. Oh, you're a villain. I'm sorry, let me walk around you. Ah, oh, he's gone! <laughs> oh, okay. I must have brought one already. Are you stupid? I swear to God, if you touch that drink. Get it, get it out of here! 
It kind of looks like a, a Confederate flag. Get it out of here. There's totally something in that drink. And we're, if I put my drink down, you're not going to know which one is which. Because you're, you're beyond stupid. You ain't no baller. That's for sure. Stop. We're drink cup with drink. We're not doing it. We're going to play... Uh, let me lower the volume. What the fuck? I can't click anything. Do I have to drink the drink? I'm pissed. I'm so upset. Let's uh let's make it reasonable so that we don't have to I don't have to scream for you guys to hear me. Uh let's see, to the future. This one sounds kinda hard. I don't hate it. Oh, I love it. We gotta play this one. Alright, let me flip the keyboard. Oh shit, we're getting started. I'm not missing a single note. Shut up. What? Is that a video? I, I literally didn't notice there was a video playing in the background. This is awesome. Is that a gorilla? I, I really shouldn't be looking at the video. Why is there a gorilla next to a fucking glass? Someone watch the video and explain it to me in the comments. I'm not missing a single one after the one I missed. Oh, okay. I need the re I need the rewind on that. That made no sense, but okay. What is the instrument that is is doing this? You know what, Chillizart? <laughs> you take that miss. You deserve it. Oh, hell no. needed to know if there was somebody there. You understand, right? No. Is there a gorilla in the cup? This is like a relevant song because we drank water, right? Strawberry something. That was nice. I like that song. By Atelier Ladybird. Oh my god, look at that. Ch Ch Mocha should be here soon. A 93.56. I should get some snack for the both of us. What should I order? Can we order from in here? She's not going to answer. Oh, she did. Yes. I'd like to order something. Okay. Just say it. Uh, pizza, fried chicken, or takoyaki? So here's the thing, right? I don't think pizza is good. It has it has cheese in it, right? And cheese is essentially milk, right? And dairy messes up the vocal cords, right? So we'll get more misses. 
fried chicken, on the other hand, it's like your fingers will get greasy, and then you're like tapping the tablet, and it like gets you nervous. You know what I mean? Because you don't want it. You don't want it on your fingers. You don't want it transferred onto another surface. I think it has to be this. It's the cleanest food. You eat it with a little stick, I think, right? Oh, we'll, we'll go with the takoyaki. Gotcha. It'll take two to three minutes. What are you, fucking popping it into the microwave, you bitch? Uh, um... You're the girl in room 12, right? The uniform. High school student, right? Uh, yes. I'm pretty sure she said, I thought so. Not dot dot dot. Why would we leave? I guess we could leave if we want. I guess we can't. Never mind. We're gonna sing again. Let's see what else we got. Oh, this is awesome. Of course we're gonna play this one. Wait a second. It sounds familiar. I guess we'll see. When we sing it. It feels like it's been pitched down. Fuck you, Chella's art. <laughs> no way. <laughs> no, I'm not standing for that one. No. Fuck me, fuck me. Who is that at the fucking door? Oh, Jesus Christ! That's what I needed to get the blood pumping. Catch me not missing a single one anymore. I'll take food over a miss. Fuck! Dude, curse my instincts, man. I saw that coming. We, uh, we're not doing too hot on this one. I'll admit. But I do like the cats on the video. It was just a bunch of different cats. I like how there's no reaction from us. Zero. We gave no fucks at all. Oh, man. Is the food ready yet? Is this really what this girl thinks about? Right now, this is the thing? I should call them up. They're probably dead, man, to be honest with you. This time, they're not gonna answer. She's not answering. I'm going to ask her in person. Get ordered food. Like, no matter which way you go, this is fucked, right? I'm gonna go around. Okay, that's better. Yeah, I don't want to go the long way. She's not here. Maybe she's in the staff room. Oh my god. Fuck. Excuse me. I don't hear anything. Let's go in. Let's go in? You can't just come in here. This is the employee's only room. Can't you read? What? Um, my order didn't arrive. 
the food, right? It should be on your table. What, you still have something to say? I'm sorry. You piss me off. I don't know who you're texting, but... I wish I had their number so I could tell them all about you. I'm a very petty person. Jesus fucking Christ with this guy. Can we call the police? There's a menace on the loose. What was that? I'm a dumb idiot. I don't I don't understand what's going on. I've never been in danger in my entire life. What did he do to my food? Fries? This is the wrong order. Was that guy one of the workers? Are we gonna eat the fries? Is that what we're gonna do? We're gonna eat the fries. Nah, don't, no, no, no. Not what I ordered. We're gonna eat the fucking fries. Hmm? There's something in the fries. What's this? An email address? Gross. Feel free to <laughs> feel free to message me. Utero eleven oh one at ya bye. Doesn't that mean very bad? Ooh, a secret song. Well that's not I've already played that song. Oh my god, I can walk. I'm invisible, but I'm walking. That's not good. Yeah. It's Unreal Engine stuff. I could explain it, but then I'd have to kill you. Enable cinematic mode, Chilla's art. Oh yeah, I'm feeling good about this one. Yeah. I'll do this so you guys can watch the door for me. Alright, I think I'm I think I'm okay as long Oh as long as no one barges into the fucking room. Oh, no, 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 no. We're not doing this fucking creepypasta shit. Oh, I don't like it. Listen. I love... I, oh, fuck. Hello, Mocha? You're late. I'm already here and singing. Mira. She's in the TV. I'm not going to the karaoke. What's wrong? Hey, hello? Uh, <laughs> fuck, man. Dude, look. Oh my god, what happened to the power? It is dead quiet in here. Am I trying to avoid that? Oh my good god, this is fucked up. What? This is Mocha's phone. Why is it here? Ok. 
catch me fucking leaving. Fuck. I hate this. This is everything I hate. Oh my good god, this is so fucked. Oh my god. Where is she? Am I collecting fucking phones here? I'm fucking leaving. Oh my god, it's around the corner, isn't it? It is. Oh my good god. I can't tell where it's coming from. Oh, okay. This is so absurd. The ambience is gone. What the f where is it? Oh, okay. Nanda. Why? Mocha, what's wrong? Nanda. Why? Didn't you help me? I called you many times. It's too late. It's not. It's not too late. I fucking knew it, man. We should have stayed. But you're wrong for trying to fucking kill me for this. You bitch. I did say we deserve to die for it, though. <laughs> Shit. I take it back. Oh my god, this couldn't be a worse feeling. You're fucked whichever way you go. There's no way. Flip phone. All right, I'm gonna just go this way and hope for the best. No, I don't want to enter the karaoke room. I want to get the fuck out of here. Are you kidding me right now? This is ridiculous. Well, I guess I could go sing another song. Oh, okay. Ugh. How long was I out? <laughs> I'm sorry, Mira. Hello, Mocha? The photo I just sent you. He noticed me sending the photo. Please don't run away from there. He's headed your way. A photo? What photo? Look at your phone, idiot. Oh my god. Who is he? Is it's it's the van guy? It's the coach? Tell me who it is so I could call the police. I feel sick. I need to go to the restroom. It's the food and the drink. You are the biggest idiot in Japan. There's no way. There's no way. You couldn't be dumber. Someone read that to me. I don't know. I don't know what it means.
Cool, I didn't need this camera, man. It's okay, like... What was the photo she was talking about? Oh? She sent me a photo. What? What's this? Coach? Could it be? I have to call Mocha. This motherfucker's gonna peek over the goddamn red. Oh my god. She's not answering. She answered. She definitely answered, but it wasn't her. It was the coach. And guess what? She's going to be calling you. Or sorry, he's going to be calling you to figure out where you are. What should I do? What should you do? That is very clear to me. Door is jammed. Oh, great. There's no way out. That's locked. Everyone's fucking gone. He blocked out. The door is blocked. It's not really blocked. It doesn't open out. It slides. We could jump over that just fine. It's not a big deal. She's totally dead, isn't she? What do you mean, not yet? Is there something I could do? See, this is... This is the Chillazart trap. You think you could do other stuff. So you look. Doors jammed. Time to look at everything, I guess. You know what? Let's look behind the counter. I'm just fucking clicking everything. No, no keys or anything. Alright, I mean, as far as I can tell, there's nothing else I can do, so I'm just gonna go in there. He's actually not here. What can I do in here? There isn't anything obvious that I can work with. Oh, CCTV, of course. <clears throat> what is that? It's like a box of something. Press any key to skip? Coach is here. Let's call the cops. You should have done this 40 minutes ago. The police said it would take four minutes for the police to get here. That's redundant. I have to hide until then. Hide? Press C to sneak. Sneaking reduces footstep sounds and visibility to the enemy. Oh my god. Dude, there's glass. What is this? Why'd you block? Caught. Dude, he. You didn't tell me he rearranged the fucking karaoke bar. He re. Like, he literally blocked the. the loop. I'll. I'll skip it. I don't need it. Let's call the cops. I don't need to see this whole cutscene again. Okay, so. I don't know, I, I don't know the layout, because obviously he boarded shit up. So, I know that he goes that way first, so let's go this way first. Let's see what's going on out here. have the janitor key. I gotta do stuff with it. Of course there's shattered glass everywhere and shit. Yeah, 
Why did the coach suddenly snap? And why didn't he just kill us where we were? What? Why is he doing this in a public, like, building? What? what? I, I want to go to the janitor's place. I want to see what's in there. Okay, I've been in here too long, I guess. Stop. Relax. He doesn't see me. I... I couldn't get out. I don't know. Do I really need to do this every time? And can I just go around and like leave through the door that he opened? Can I do that? In any case, I want to grab the key and go to the janitor's closet. I can't believe I can do that. If I can sneak up behind him. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> well, that's easier said than done. Okay. So it's not enough to just, uh, it's not enough to just, like, go and speedrun that. You actually have to hide. I think I know, I think I know how to do this. So here's, here's the path. First we get the key, then we wait. Then we get the knife, then we kill. Because he's he's gonna go this way. Towards the knife. And when he goes towards the knife, we go behind him. Unless he's like completely random, which is totally possible. So he's going that way. He's gonna go towards that. I'm gonna go this way. That's blocked off. Oh, he's coming back over this way? What? He's a very weird person. Okay. So new new plan. We have to just do this as fast as possible because he doesn't open that door. So we could actually probably just kill him right away. Here, I'll show you what I mean. Oh, dude, you are faster than ever. You don't usually get there that fast. What the fuck? He has to walk over this way. I have no idea where he is. Um... Don't be, don't be shutting doors on me for no reason. Well, this is a pretty good strategy, I think. I don't, I can't think of a better plan than having a knife and waiting anyway. I just noticed the door rotates and goes through the door frame. Interesting doors in Japan. We're gonna kill this fucker. I want him to come over here. I want to kill him. That's the American way, but I'm not gonna force it either. <laughs> 
can turn off the power all you want, bitch. The power's still on in here. How did he even do that from inside the building? He's not even moving anymore. Oh, he's getting mad. Oh, the police is coming, dude. You better come over this way. I have stood here for fucking three and a half minutes. Oh, looks like I made it. I fucking did it by not doing anything. When I saw the cops show up, my whole body just relaxed. And the next thing I know, I was lying in a hospital bed. Jesus Christ. The police found out that the coach had raped more than 10 students. My friend came to visit me at the hospital and told me that they had caught him right away. My friend's been through so much. She's still so traumatized from what happened. Even now, she avoids being near men. Well, I can fucking totally understand that. It's been a while now, and she's slowly getting better. Oh, why couldn't we just stay with her? Oh, my God. Even, even... Dude, even as a kid, even as a boy... I would never have allowed my friends to be with any adult as a kid. Never. Like, it just, it, it never crossed my mind that I would let somebody be alone with somebody else. Not like this. But I know for sure that the fear still lingers within her. Ending six out of six. I think that means we got all of them. Achievement unlocked, ending six. <clears throat> God damn it. The karaoke. Ooh, is that a hint? So there's a camera. Okay, these are hints of endings. Interesting. Let's let's start from uh, the staff room. I want to kill this fucking guy. I'm gonna do it. See, like he goes that way, and then he'll like. I guess the glass doesn't matter. Oh fuck, I missed my chance. I missed my chance to just kind of go around. I'm dumb. That's like exactly what we want to happen, but I didn't take advantage of it. Did he go the other way? Oh my god, this guy's so annoying. Got him. Oh my gosh. Oh. 
He's dying like a bitch. <laughs> The police arrived and the coach was taken to the hospital, but he didn't make it. It was ruled as self-defense, so I wasn't charged with anything. The guilt of taking someone's life. And the relief that there will be no more victims. Just hit me with a wave of emotions. It's overwhelming. It was the only way for me at the time. I still can't shake off that feeling. The memory of it still haunts me like a recurring nightmare. Will there ever come a day when I will be free from him? Ending one of six. Man, that is tough. That really is tough. But, you know what? It is a burden worth carrying. It is a cross worth carrying. Because... I mean, shit, man. No more victims, you know? All the previous victims know that he's gone. It's like a, a huge relief, I would imagine. So, yeah, it really sucks that you have to be the one to carry that burden, but at the same time... I don't know. Isn't he dead? I thought he died. Or is it like, they said he didn't make it. Did I read it wrong? <laughs> what? Oh shit, what? It's already this late. Oh, can we avoid the whole thing just by telling her it's this late? It's late. Oh yeah, I wasn't checking the time. Then let's clean up quickly and go to karaoke. I'll pick up the ball you mop, okay? Whoa. Where's the mop? Oh my god, is he gonna be around here? Where is she? This is fucked up. How does this happen? And how does a ball... How, do, how does a mop fix this? How does a ball do this and how does a mop fix this? Done? Thanks for mopping. Let's change our clothes and go karaoke. Oh my god, I fucking saved her. And now the camera's down there, right? Yeah, it's right there. What is this? Someone's been taking a video? Who would do such a thing? Why are you still here? Uh... Damn, this is totally a branch. Well, look. I would say I found this in the women's locker room. Because the first one is so suspicious. 
What's this? Give it to me, I'll report it to the school. You didn't tell anyone else about it, right? I think so. Don't tell anyone in case they get scared. It's late. I'll give you a ride. No! Moko, Moko is here. Moko? Moka? Moka is here. Have you seen her? My car can only fit two people, so... I'll ask teacher Sasaki to bring her home. I'll pick you home. You go ahead and get into my truck. Put your bike on the back of my truck. This is the key to my truck. This is really fucked up. But... I gotta get my bike. Fuck, man. I couldn't leave well enough alone, huh? I couldn't just walk away. Well, I'm gonna look in that glove compartment, though. We're gonna go all the fucking way. It's a folder. What in the... is this? Oh no. They're all girls from the school. I have to take this to the police station nearby now. Are we gonna be able to? No time to ride a bike. Fuck me, man. I don't think we're gonna make it. Let's get the hell out of here, dude. I know exactly where it is, but there's no fucking way. Where are you going? I told you to wait in the car. Ooh. Oh my god. Thank goodness I know where the police station is, but I don't know if we'll make it. Doshita, which means what's wrong. As I tried to speak up, a cop came over to me and said, You can talk to me once you've calmed down a bit. I'll never forget that moment. I remember showing him the picture and telling him everything I knew about the camera and the coach. And before I knew it, they caught him. Everyone was shocked that he could be capable of something like that. The school brought in a counselor. To help all the students who had been affected by him. I just hope something like this. Never ever. Happens again. That's a lot of words for happens again. Ending five of six. Damn man. Well we know how to get the other endings. Shit. Yeah, we got him. We got him, guys. We got him. <laughs> not probably not the song I'd use to celebrate the fact, but all right, this time I'm not going to notice the uh the camera. What? The police station is nearby. No time to ride a bike. What do you mean? 
I guess we'll leave, but it's one of the endings that we don't have conclusive evidence or whatever. What do you have there? Show it to me. What should I do? I have to run. Oh. I don't think I'll make it this time. Just because that would be a different ending, right? What? Is it the same ending? I handed the camera over to the cop and filled him in on everything that went down. I was freaking out, so I shot a quick text to my friend. The officer kindly listened to my whole story, then, in then decided to investigate. Later, the officer told me. Later on, he told me that they couldn't figure out who did it because all they found were my fingerprints on the camera. He also said they were going to have extra patrols around my school. That day was crazy. My friend kept blowing up my phone with calls. But I couldn't answer them. I was shook myself. My friend has been in low spirits since that day. And then, one day, she took her own life. There wasn't even a note or anything. Something must have happened to her after the incident. I wish I had been able to answer the phone that day. I still can't shake the guilt I feel about what happened after that day. Ending 3 of 6. Dude, every ending is like perpetual guilt. Even when you kill the fucking guy, you, you, you feel guilty about something. I mean, I guess it is a complicated situation. Alright, so for this one, I think we want to get caught, basically. We're killing it. Oh, no way. We need one more. Ah, oh, we're... Damn it. That's so lame. Okay. So now, we can get dressed. We're gonna grab the camera and tell him about it. I guess, and then get caught? I found it. So now we're gonna get our bike and we're gonna stay in the car, I guess. And then I think the other ending is to get caught while running to the police station. That's my guess, because I, I can't think of anything else. There we go. Kept you waiting. Let's get going. This is fucked up. Thank God Chilazar didn't show anything. I still can't bring myself to talk to anyone about what happened to me after that day. It's just too hard. 
Ever since then, I've been really scared of men. I've never even been in a relationship with a guy. It's been so tough. I just hope that there's someone out there who can understand what I'm going through. There's plenty. Unfortunately. I sincerely hope that there will be fewer people like me in the world. That's why killing him is the good ending. Ending four of six. Well, actually, I don't think it is the good ending. Because doesn't he, isn't he still alive? Ending four. Okay. What I think is the last ending we're going to get right now. Okay, so I have the key. What do I do with this? What can I do with this key? <laughs> Clicking on the camera would give me a totally different ending, so... Where the hell are you going? Let me check all the doors again. I don't think the camera's the right answer. Let me check all the lockers. Oh, you know what? Why can't I? Oh, shoes. Maybe, maybe I can use the key when she's next to me? At the bike or whatever? I don't have the key, though. Oh no, I don't have my key. I must have left it in my locker. You go ahead. You left your key inside the locker. Thanks. Let's go then. Oh, okay. <laughs> We let go of all the stress from studying and extracurricular activities and just sang our hearts out. We had a great time. We went home before 10 p.m. It was a fun night. Ending two of six. That's right, baby. That's all the endings. I'm a genius. Yay! Yay! This game is fucking dark. This is a nice ending, but there's still a predator on the loose in your school, and you have no idea. So is it a good ending? I don't know. It's arguable. Alright, so what do I think of the karaoke? I think that this game deals with some pretty rough subject matter. And it does it in a very raw, kind of direct way. Uh, usually these things are more implicit and subtle. For example, like Angela in Silent Hill 2 when she's, she's being abused by her father, and it, it's, it's handled in a way that is a little more subtle, and you don't really know what's going on until you have to know what's going on. In this game, you can pretty much tell right the fuck away that something is wrong. And I guess that's a good thing, because that is an instinct that everyone is born with. You can just kind of feel when something isn't okay. And I think they, that, that gets carried across really nicely in this game. As for if it's done in good or poor taste, I that's up for you to decide, really, because I have a different opinion than you do, right? I don't know. I don't like playing games with this kind of subject matter because it's just not something that I want to think about. Obviously, it exists, and just uh, you can't just turn a blind eye to it, but there are a few things that I could never put in my games. And one of those things is like being chased by a predator. As scary as it is, it's not something that I would like to subject my players to. And I know in, in, in my game Traffic, 
some people think that the sleep paralysis that is happening in that game is like uh, a form of, of molestation. And that's like interpretation, really, because for me, it's just sleep paralysis. But for them, it's that. And I'm not going to take that away from them because that's their interpretation, but I would never put that stuff in my games. That's just how I feel about it. As for the technical aspect and the story and stuff of this game, this is probably one of Chilla's Art's best games in terms of optimization. The game runs great, which is unexpected considering it's version 1, and they usually don't get that right until about version 200. So that's good. Story-wise, it's scary, man. The voice acting is on point, too. It's really good. Whoever this female lead is, her voice is perfect for this kind of game. The story is what the story is. It's you, You'll either like it or you hate it. It's not like there's any kind of... Well, there's one thing I can say about it that I don't really understand, which is in that first ending, or like if you play through the game normally and you go through the karaoke, there's a moment where Mocha comes back dead with like blood in her eyes and stuff and she's like why why did you leave me and i don't know if that means that the main character knows what is happening and doesn't do anything about it because in order for have these guilty delusions or nightmares she has to understand to, to some capacity what is happening to mocha otherwise why would you think anything of it like why would you have this nightmare you wouldn't so it's either that she knows and is turning a blind eye to it or there's some like supernatural element to this. I don't know. It's hard to say really with Chilla's art because some things are based in reality and then they're just wacky out of nowhere. Eh, I like it though. I think this game is okay for what it is. I think it's fine. I hope you guys enjoyed it despite all of its, you know, rough subject matter and stuff. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider subscribing and I'll uh, see you guys soon. Bye-bye.